brothers racing right next to each other. In the black is Kyle Kruxov. And he was the winner of our first event in St. Paul. He's got his younger brother, Scotty Croxall, to his left. This is it, the big final for Falkenberg. Amazingly, Fabian Mills does it again with the whole shot. He's been incredible all weekend long. Scotty Croxall in the back of the pack right now with Kyle Croxall passing Fabian Mills when he went down to the face plant. Fabian got back up and was lucky that Scotty Croxall just crashed into the wall there. Now he's slowing down as Pavel Klintrup comes hard around the outside and passes Croxall, who's sitting way in back. Kyle Croxall out in front of the black jersey. Fabian Mills from Germany in blue right behind him as they head towards the shoot to the big air, and it is all Kyle Croxall over the big air. Kyle Croxall absolutely dominating the race, Troy. He brings it home two in a row. Croxall wins the first of it, claims the second here in Valkenburg. What a great performance by all four of our finalists, and you could see why Crashed Ice is that exciting. It is not over until it's complete as we go back to the top of the course to see how this thing got going. You can see the start here, Todd. Scotty Croxall has been so good out of the start. And Fabian Mel's right there with him. And in fact, the mistake by Scotty Croxall at the step-up jump was what cost him the position. Fabian Mel's really played it well. Pavel Klintrup feeling confident with that double at the Dutch Mountains. Goes for the big jump. Doesn't quite work out for him that time like it did the last time around. We can see it again here. And he goes down for the belly flop right here where they really need to stay on their feet. Kyle Croxall keeps the good line. Fabian Mel's chasing him down. Here comes Pablo Klintrup and Scotty Croxall bringing up the rear. And that's obviously where he had the problem with his blade because you don't see him going for it hard. And it is the winner, Kyle Croxall, adding his score once again and moving into the third event in Sweden with 2,000 points in his box. Let's check in now with South Africa. Kyle Croxall, second champagne bath in a row, my friend. Congratulations. Take us through that final. Uh, it was a crazy final. I mean, uh, pretty much our semi-final was the final, and then we had the, the final with all top guys again, so it was two tough races. Uh, started out as fast as I could, came out in second, and made the pass at the second jump, so uh, from there on, I was just trying to stay up front. What's your goal as we head into Ari now? You are the man with the target on your back. Obviously, it's going to put a little bit of pressure on yourself. How do you stay focused uh, for the goal of winning this overall championship? 